hi guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys all of my january favorites i have a lot of january favorites but i do also have one fail for you guys but before we begin if this is your first time watching and you are not subscribed to my channel make sure that you click that subscribe button right now and also don't forget to click the notification bell so that way youtube will notify you every time i post a new video and just so you know i do post three to five days a week so i would love to have you why not join me and without further ado let's get right into it so the first thing that i'm going to talk to you guys about is makeup so the first one that i rediscovered this month is this one right here so this is the photo folklore i can never say that oh my gosh photo focus concealer by wet n wild and this one is in the color or in the shade fair beige it looks like this and guys i really love this now this is more of a thinner consistency it's not full coverage but it is buildable and i really really love this so if you're into like a really good concealer but you want it to be affordable like a drugstore affordable concealer this is amazing this is only 488 and then the next one that i've been loving so much this month is this one right here so this is the milani amour satin matte liquid lipstick so this one is in the color fancy and it looks like this this is such a beautiful color it's more like a pinkish mauve color but it's so flattering colors like this sometimes do not look right on me for some reason but this one looks so so pretty it's that type of color that you want to wear every single day the difference between this one and the other a uh, more matte that uh lip lip creams that they have is that this is a satin matte and the other ones they have are just the regular matte colors but the funny thing is i can't really tell a difference between the satin matte and the regular matte to me they look like the same so just letting you guys know that they do have satin matte and regular matte when it comes to the milani lip creams but i really love them i have several of these guys and they're amazing like you really need to try it if you're looking for a really good drugstore liquid lipstick like a matte liquid lipstick try milan they don't dry out my lips i don't feel like they're on me they don't bother me they're opaque they stand all day they don't fall apart they don't crumble it's not streaky or anything it applies beautifully so i love it wet n wild also has really good liquid lipsticks that are really good quality too just in case you guys are looking for a really good quality drugstore liquid lipstick so you're welcome okay moving on to some false lashes these are the Ardell Double Up Double Wispies False Lashes. These are amazing. I always love the Wispies by Ardell, but then I found out about the Double Wispies. I love it. They are genius, and I feel like it gives you the perfect amount of volume, but it just looks so beautiful. It's so nice. You don't feel them on your eyes. For me, that's a big deal if the strip lash is heavy you could definitely feel it on your eyes all day it does bug me if it's that if that's the case and a lot of times i notice that if they're a little heavy they tend to like unglue themselves and they stick out right here like towards um the inside it's so ugly so these don't do that i highly recommend you get these i did get these on amazon for like 16 dollars for four pairs and i do think that's a really great buy so if you're looking for really awesome lashes get you these you're gonna thank me i'm moving on to a makeup palette so i've been loving this one right here this is the ColourPop cloud spun this is a nine pan palette this is the more newer one that they just released not long ago i really love it now it is not what i have on my eyes right now i do have the color pop what is that called um blush crush which is similar but not really so this is just beautiful if you are into like light pink shades you're gonna love this i think this is perfect if you're into wearing makeup that's more like shimmery light color like a pop of color but it's not too bold it's not too crazy and if you're afraid of wearing like really bold vibrant colors this is perfect to start off because they're really easy to blend out they're light colors they're really pretty they're easy to work with they're they're just beautiful guys and they're very blendable they're very opaque though but i will say that obviously they do have some colors that are really bold so if you want to go all out i mean you can go with this one right here this is really really vibrant 
but one thing like i said i really love about this is that they blend out so beautifully so i really do love this i've been loving this right here it's more of a baby like light baby pink and this one right here i think this is really pretty it's like a straight up glitter but i love it and this is really pretty in the crease i i've been really loving this one in the crease it just gives you a right nice beautiful like nudish pink color it's just gorgeous so if you guys haven't tried this i do recommend you try this because it is amazing and i just love the packaging as well i feel like they do such a great job they do have the names of of the colors on the back as well now moving on to nail polish i have one nail polish that i want to mention to you guys and it is this wet n wild one step wonder gel nail polish and it says that there is no uv lamp needed this is in the condensed milk and I really love this. I don't have anything on my nails right now. But guys, I wore this twice already. So the moment it started chipping off, I reapplied it again. And I only used this. I did not use a base coat or a top coat. And I'm actually really impressed. I feel like a lot of times with nail polish, they could give out like really gimmicky claims of it lasting a week. Or, you know, um, just crazy out there claims where you know it's not true. But this one, I'm really impressed. I feel like it does give you that shine where it does look like you have gel nails. And guys, the thing that really shocked me is the fact that it lasted me five days without chipping. That's rare. I have a lot of nail polish. I even have high-end nail polish. And they last no more than two days and they start chipping on me. And yes, I am sometimes like a gorilla and I just go crazy and I just... I always use my hands for everything, obviously. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like I could be more rough with my hands. And this did not chip for five days, which is rare for me. So I'm really impressed with this. I did get this at Dollar Tree. So if you see it at Dollar Tree and you want, like, a really beautiful nude color, pick it up, guys, because this is amazing. I did see other colors that Dollar Tree carries in this nail polish, but I only got this one. One thing I also want to mention, it does dry really fast, so... You don't have to worry about like waiting around for it to dry. It dries really fast. So I'm really impressed. Moving on to the next item is this one right here. This I got at Dollar Tree and it's an eyebrow trimmer. So it looks like this. And I'm really happy that I picked this up. If you guys have like bushy, long eyebrows like me, you really need this. Or even if you just want to trim them. Because obviously if you don't take care of your brows and you just let them sprout like crazy they will go crazy and they start doing their own thing and for me especially i have long ones that some of them want to go down this one i love because i can just brush and and trim brush and trim you have a lot of control and i really really love this if you were to buy this on amazon it would be at least five dollars but it's at dollar tree and i'm really really impressed so now i'm going to move on to the fashion part so the first one I'm gonna mention is this one right here. So this handbag was gifted to me by my oldest daughter. It is from Amazon, it's red. Oh my gosh, it is like the perfect, beautiful red color. Now they do have these in multiple colors. I really love the white and the yellow that they have as well. But I think they have like 10 colors. It's just so, so beautiful. I always wanted a beautiful red bag, but I'm so picky with red. I want my red to be a true red, not an orange red or a light red or a pinkish red. I want a true, true red. And this is a true red that I just love. I love the chain. I think the chain um, detail and the quality is amazing. And it's gold, obviously. You guys know I love gold hardware. So it looks like this. It is a small bag, so... This is more of like going out or if you need a bag where you just want to put your phone, your keys, maybe your your cards, your credit cards. This is the one for you. This will not fit a lot just because it's structure. So it's not like you can kind of shove things in and make it fit. But this is just beautiful. So if you're looking like for the perfect red color bag, this is the one. And now this is like so sentimental to me because my daughter got it for me and I'm definitely going to keep it forever because of course. But I really love this and I wanted to mention it. I'm going to link it down below. Like I said, this is from Amazon and I think it was like $20. And a pair of ankle boots that I wanted to mention to you guys are these right here. These are so, so beautiful. So these were actually gifted to me by one of my best friends. So these, she got them for me from Route 21. Guys you would not guess how cheap these were 
These were on sale for $7. So Rue 21 is trying to get rid of all their winter um, fashion, like their shoes and clothes. And they have such crazy deals right now. So I went with my best friend shopping and she bought these for me. And I was so excited. They were $7, so well worth it. Amazon has these exact same boots for about $25. And these were seven. They are so amazing. I love the color. I love everything about it. They're stretchy. I will link the Amazon link down below. Like I said, these are from Route 21, but the Amazon do carry these exactly the same. They don't have the exact same color like this, but they do have multiple colors like black and brown, burgundy, and some other colors. I think they have like 10 colors. And I did get the ones in the black from Amazon. So because I love these so much, I had to get the black from Amazon because they're just so, so amazing. These, they call it like the Chelsea style boots. Moving on to one Walmart find that I really, really love. So it is this one right here. This is a Valentine's Day mug. They do have like three other kinds, but I got this one. I really love it. I don't have any Valentine's Day mugs and this one really caught my eye. It has a heart right here. It has like um hearts popping out and this was only 3.98 which i think that's a really great buy i usually like to buy the mugs that are a little bit bigger because i like to have a lot of tea but honestly i think this is just perfect i don't know if it says how many ounces it actually does so it's 13.5 ounces it's a really nice beautiful mug now moving on to two food items and it is these two right here so these are the lenny and larry's the complete cookie these are like the seasonal christmas cookies that they only bring out around the christmas time so the first one is the peppermint chocolate and then this one is the gingerbread this one is my favorite i do wish they would still bring it out and have this year round because i really really love this one this one i think is okay i did enjoy it but not as much as this one now i know they have the chocolate mint um that is year round if you guys never tried the lenny and larry's cookies you really need to they're like a protein cookie do fill me up on those days where i have to do a lot of errands like run errands and do a lot of stuff and sometimes i don't even have time to eat i like to keep this in my bag and just eat it whenever I'm hungry it does help me out it does satisfy my sweet tooth as well and they are amazing they do have those in like 10 other flavors that are year round for one fail item that i don't recommend you get um it is this one right here so i purchased this from dollar tree these are the pantyhose in the color black and i got it in the queen size which queen size is like the size large i do get size large in tights because i don't like them to be tight on me like obviously it's still tight but not like crazy tight where it's restricting okay i don't recommend this because the the tights are the color of the like the black color is very uneven it makes my legs look patchy like there's a patch of more darker black and then lighter black it's so so weird i do not recommend this i was really hoping that it would work out because it's a dollar they do also have the nude one but this one that i tried in the black guys i don't recommend it and not only that it is so thin i know this is gonna break on me like probably after one use it's horrible quality so this unfortunately is a fail the one that i do recommend is the one from walmart uh the name brand is called legs l-e-g-g-s that one is really good i have purchased it it's like six dollars but it's really amazing and that one i definitely recommend but that this one right here, unfortunately, it's a fail. Anyways, I really hope that you guys enjoyed my January favorites and fails. Unfortunately, I have one fail for the month. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, remember, stay blessed. Bye.